All right, Leo, it's your turn. I don't know how you're gonna feel about my new deck, but so far I'm really loving it. So if you don't like it, feel free to drop me a comment. What messages do you have for Leo now that we are going into retrograde? What messages do you have for Leo? Ooh, your money looks good. I feel like you have a whole new direction, a whole new wish, wish fulfillment right now, and um, you are going out and getting it. Yes, you are. Honestly, this is amazing. I feel like you could be, you know, potentially investing somewhere or, you know, getting a pay raise, uh, opening a new business, something of that nature. I really do like it's it's good. I feel like the, at least a few of you had some sort of great business idea that really took off. It's definitely like a, this is giving that sort of vibe. Um, your emotions, though, are not are not. I, I don't know, you're holding back emotion for some reason. Maybe you're getting out of something or maybe you just don't have time for any sort of um, connection, you know, now that you are focused. Um, you are still remembering somebody who left you out in the cold. They're still on your mind and that could be part of the problem. It's still a very heavy burden to you. It could have been a Pisces. We did pull Pisces twice. Everybody's pulling Pisces today. I don't know what's up with that. Like, I don't know what we're doing to people, but <laughs> it's not good. It's not good, okay? Um, so you had some sort of situation where they may have kind of like messed your world up a little bit. Um, Let's continue. You're really carrying this burden. It's saying you're gonna walk away. You're gonna manifest something new. Um, and with the Wheel of Fortune, everything's possible. Absolutely everything. Unfortunately, you're still carrying this weight of, of, of depression and whatnot. Um, be careful. Be careful with this. Um, Be careful holding on to your money too tightly, I guess that's a good way to put it. Because if there's an opportunity that comes up where you could make a very small investment, I'm not talking anything big, but I'm talking about like even just lending somebody's money to help them out with, with a project, um, as long as they're gonna pay you back, of course. I feel like you could get into some sort of conflict by refusing to do so or by just being too selfish. And, uh, it, it will ruin whatever this relationship is with this person. I, so if you don't care, like, you know, whatever. Uh, there is some sort of fight here. There is some sort of chaos here. Let's see what's going on. Again, I feel like you're really holding back emotionally for some reason. There's a, there's a really big selfish energy here, and I don't know what is going on with you that is, is making you feel that way, but clearly somebody has hurt you enough for you to feel like you have to hold back emotions, but also hold back, like, sort of like your only focus right now is money, okay? Because um, even passion's coming in reverse. You're really hesitating moving on, but there's somebody else. There's somebody else coming in. There is. There is another person, but it's saying, like, there's not going to be a celebration. There's not going to be, and this person could have a child, just an FYI. Um, and then passion is on the bottom. Oh, my stomach just growled. And then passion is on the uh, bottom of the deck as well. So if, if you're looking to get involved or you think that that's something you would want in the future, I would say... You need to you need to be more open to it, but you also need maybe to do a little healing or um, maybe put less focus on you know finances or whatever direction you're taking right now because there is somebody literally around the corner. There's like the three of cups. It could be a huge celebration where you really have a good time with this person out and about. But with all this hesitation here and all this like 
it's not selfish like you're mean. It's like selfish like, well, I'm not going to bother. Like, I'm, you're just going to waste my time sort of thing. Oh, Leo, I get it. Trust me. <laughs> and that's all I have for you.